How do you bring your topic to life? In this lesson, you will learn how to describe your topic by constructing a web with adjectives that tell about your topic. Let's review. This is the prompt that we're going to be writing about. Think about the people, places, or activities in your life that make you happy. Pick one thing to focus on. Describe what that thing is and how it makes you happy. In the last lesson, we generated a list of possible topics. We eliminated them one by one and finally chose my mom by using the strength test. A common mistake that you might make would be only describing one aspect of your topic, like what it looks like. I'm going to follow these steps in my lesson. Step one, draw a blank web and write your topic in the middle. Step two, brainstorm different ways you can describe your topic. And step three, write one adjective in each outer bubble. Okay, Th this is going to be my first step in planning my writing. Because it asked me to describe my topic, I need to take time to brainstorm adjectives, words to describe. This is the blank web that I'm making, and the circle in the middle is going to contain my topic. So I'm going to say my mom. The outer bubbles is where my adjectives are going to go. So next, I need to brainstorm you know, things that I need to put in this web. So I want to think about a bunch of different ways that I can describe my topic. I need to think about what it looks like. I also need to think about what it sounds like, what it feels like. And most importantly, if my person, if my topic is a person like mine, you need to think about what is that person's personality like. Okay. Finally, after I've brainstormed, I need to write down each adjective as I think of it in my web. So let's see, my topic is my mom. My mom is very short. That's always one of the first things you notice about her. She also has brown hair and brown eyes. I think that pretty much covers what she looks like. Let's see. So, let's see, she has a very serious personality as well. Let's see, I want to think about more personality traits. Um, she makes sure her family feels very loved. And let me get one more. Uh, let's see, oh, she has a really cheesy sense of humor. She loves those knock-knock jokes. Okay, so now I have my five ways that I can describe my topic. All right, did you see what I did? I followed these steps. Number one. Draw a blank web and write your topic in the middle. Step two, brainstorm different ways you can describe your topic. And step three, write one adjective in each outer bubble. Now I want you to try this with your writing.